video that we've ever made. Mm -hmm. How many what about? You, I got about 150 views. Uh -huh. And all you gotta do is to yeah. go to uh, DR, J-H-A-N-E-Y, mm -hmm. click that, mm -hmm. and that'll give you all my stuff and write your name. All right. Yeah. You got all okay. the things. I've got 70,000. Mm, wow. Uh, Big pots. Yeah. No, One, two, that. three, four, five. How's that? Okay. All right. One, two, three, four, five. One, One two, two, three, three four, four, five. five. Say now, these two shows will be One, two, three, four, five. how on YouTube this time next week. Okay. We'll have both of them on there. Okay. And part of that. <laughs> oh, one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> one, two, three, four, five. One, now, two, three, four, five. The spiritual leadership spiritual of mine. One, two, <laughs> three, right. yeah, four, yeah, five. That's right, yeah. That's okay. You know, I one, got five, two, three, four. This is the third <laughs> of five. Okay. You see, and so, uh, yeah, I forget. You see, but can't nobody make I, no mess I, out of this I show go, but me. I'm glad you said so, it three <laughs> times so I know what it is. <laughs> the spiritual leadership of Dr. M. L. Key. Is that right? Yeah, mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, yes, yes, fix it up so that uh, we can get some shots of it and run it through there. Yeah, you need to take, don't use my copy on the top because it's a little. That's to go in the top one or. or use the yeah. one next to it. Either one, either one got, of those. Yeah, I got a tape on mine. You see the tape at the top? Don't use that one. Are use the one the you same, got in your. They're all the same. Yeah, book, use right? that one. Yeah, I was gonna say that. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they'll make a, a shot of it. I think this might look a little bit better than mine, though. <laughs> Baldwin, Anderson, Anderson and, and Howard. Howard. Yeah. Howard, Anderson, and Baldwin. Mm -hmm. Victor Anderson, Aaron, Aaron Joshua Howard. <laughs> and see, what'll happen is that I'll forget his name. Yeah, <laughs> right. You, years, got, you, you, got that, you got that one down. <laughs> <laughs> I'll forget your uh, you got that one Mr. Dan. Doctor, yeah. Doctor, Doctor. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Dr. Lewis Baldwin. Yeah, going for almost thirty years. Thirty you know, years, and he's been with us. Aaron, so Aaron your <laughs> pants were apparently very biblical. I'm sorry. They, your pants were very biblical because they, the name they gave you. Yes, sir. Aaron Joshua. Oh, is that what it is? Uh, yeah. Well, the Howard and uh, Dr. Howard and Dr. Anderson yeah. and Dr. Baldwin mm -hmm. and Dr. Hayne. And I known okay. Baldwin for twenty six years. That. Okay. Okay. What you mean, Baldwin? Pardon me? Where did you first 92. meet? I met him at Vanderbilt. At Vanderbilt? Uh, in 92 yeah. we 92. met. Mm -hmm. 92. Yeah. Been friends ever since. Yeah. Now well, you, you knew Kelly Miller, Nola Smith, and I that didn't. group, huh? I Peter met him. I, I met know, him. Uh, Peter yeah. Parrish. In fact, he I, got... I, I knew Peter, but not here at Vanderbilt. Uh-huh. As, uh -huh. as a mentor. Uh -huh. I was here one year with Peter. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And I met uh, Kelly Miller yeah. when I came for my interview. He died a day before I got here. You know, in in uh, June of '84. Is that when he died? Mm-hmm. Yeah. We've been together ever since. Yeah. The name of the show again is what? The spiritual leadership of Martin, Martin Luther King, King, King Jr. King. Okay. <clears throat> and what we can, you know, the each of us have made a has made a contribution mm -hmm. to that book. He has chapter one, he has done chapter four. Okay. Uh, and, and they can both talk authoritatively about what's in their chapters. And, uh, you know, look so at- So what, what, what we're gonna do is that I'm gonna start with uh, 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 Dr. Howard on this end and have mm -hmm. you to give me some information and et cetera and et cetera. Mm -hmm. And then Dr. Anderson, I'll, yeah. after that, I'll go with Dr. Anderson mm -hmm. and then I'll come to Dr. Baldwin. All right. And that will be six minutes, mm -hmm. you see, which is to say that when I uh, talk about your background, education, and your experiences, 
give me about a two minute statement in reference to who you are and how you got to be where you are. Mm -hmm. Then uh, Dr. Anderson, the same thing, you know, okay. sort of a statement, two minutes okay. about who you are, I, and et cetera. I follow his model. The, oh, oh, okay. <laughs> and all, they, got, they got a lot more to say than I do. <laughs> and also this question of why they're involved in this project. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, yeah, we'll get around why they're involved yeah. in what this we're trying, What we're yeah. trying to do, we get your background, education, and experiences, first three minutes. I understand. Then in the eight minutes, we get to the spiritual leadership of Dr. Martin Luther okay. King. Mm -hmm. And then that 10 minutes, we will sort you out. You know, mm -hmm. you mm -hmm. have a specialty dealing with that aspect of it, et cetera, mm -hmm. et cetera. Mm -hmm. And that way we'll have an opportunity to deal exactly. with all of it. Exactly, Sounds good yeah. to me. Mm -hmm. And remember, nobody can mess this up with me. <laughs> <laughs> you, just, you just feel free. <laughs>
the role of Pentecostalism in the pursuit of social justice. So I attended Fuller Theological Seminary in California, um, came here to Vanderbilt to finish the PhD, and just really uh, completed it in 2017. Um, Dr. Baldwin here served uh, as my dissertation advisor, and Dr. Anderson as my mentor, and helped shape the project and bring it to fruition. And I ended up writing my dissertation um, on the black church and black theology. And so I'm excited to be a part of the show talking about Dr. King and his spiritual leadership. Mm -hmm. um, right now, I uh, teach here in Nashville um, at a high school called Christ Presbyterian Academy, where I teach Bible there. So that's what I'm doing now, um, having just graduated from Vanderbilt. Very good. And Dr. Mm -hmm. Anderson? Yes, thank you. Uh, tw 26 years in uh, Vanderbilt University Divinity School. <laughs> I've met Dr. Baldwin uh, 26 years ago as we look at each other. <laughs> and it was a pleasure to collaborate with him in editing the volume that we're discussing today. I came to Vanderbilt as a graduate from Princeton University in religion, ethics, and politics, having first studied at Calvin Theological Seminary in Grand Rapids, Michigan. Uh, while in Grand Rapids, I was pastor of Greece Christian Reformed Church, but also taught at Calvin College. Prior to that, I was uh, in Chicago as a minister for many years as a minister of music, but also as a social worker. It was in those years as a social worker that I became deeply influenced about issues of social justice, uh, crime, incarceration. Already then, incarceration was a major issue of young people that I was working with as a social worker in Chicago. Mm -hmm. I am the product of Georgia grandparents who each, my grandmother especially, was deeply involved in politics in Chicago, and she took me as a little boy, <laughs> took me as a little boy to the alderman's office <laughs> to show me how politics work, <laughs> how it doesn't work, how to organize communities. So from a very young age, I was tempted by community organizing, tempted by uh, questions of social justice. I did not come to uh, Dr. King easily. I grew up in the age of black power, and, 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 and black power was the ideology that drove me. Mm -hmm. But I quickly turned in my own study to the power of Dr. King, and so it was a, it was a, I'm a latecomer mm -hmm. uh, to the study of Dr. King, but also to understand the power of Dr. King mm -hmm. and his ministry for social justice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And of course, Dr. Baldwin, I think we're just about out of this first segment. And, yeah, uh, yeah. I think one thing we could say about you during this last minute, and when we come back, we've got eight minutes, and we'll allow, we'll start with you. Uh -huh. But uh, one thing we can uh, say about you is that you've been with us almost yeah. since the very, very oh, first absolutely. day, and yeah. that uh, you've mm -hmm. delivered us uh, excellent information, but you've also delivered us mm -hmm. excellent in individuals, yeah. and uh, we're delighted to have the two individuals that you have with you uh, this morning, mm -hmm. and when we come back, gentlemen, what we'll do, we'll start with uh, Dr. Baldwin, mm -hmm. and then we'll go to you, Dr. Anderson, mm -hmm. and then Dr. Howard. We'll have each of you to speak to some specific things in reference to uh, some of the reasons that you're here. Yeah. And so what we'll do, we'll take our first commercial break, and we'll be back with our audience following this very, very short commercial break. And then we'll launch into a discussion the, the, that's of right. uh -huh. yeah, Sorry. the book, because we're all contributors mm -hmm. to the, to mm -hmm. the volume. Yeah. Yeah, we'll, it's going to be shown right on. Yeah, um, yeah they've got it here. Uh -huh. <coughs> mm. I'll, I'll yeah, I'll introduce us again, and we'll start with you since we uh, left mm -hmm. off with uh, Dr. Emerson. Mm -hmm. and uh, have you make some statements in reference to your situation, because even though you've been with us thousands of times, <laughs> But uh, there might be just one individual that, yeah. that individual there uh, from Vanderbilt University and et cetera. Mm -hmm. and see, and so I. Uh, yeah, we'll have eight minutes. So let's I'm move you back a little bit. Oh, okay. How's that? I'm happy. Yeah. I'm happy if you're happy. <laughs> and so, Dr. Baldwin, when we, when we come back, We'll start, you might make some statements in reference to, you know, background, Yeah, and background, then but sort of launch us into the into discussion. Into the discussion in reference to this, mm -hmm. and then uh, when we, I realize that we're into discussion yeah, time, right. pick mm -hmm. up on what he leaves mm -hmm. off. Mm -hmm. 
Thank you and welcome back to the second segment of the show for today. We're talking to Drs. Baldwin, Anderson, and Howard, and they're giving us some information in reference to their background, education, and some of their experiences. And I think we were able to get that information from uh, Howard and uh, uh, <coughs> Johnson. Anderson. Anderson. Howard and Anderson <laughs> and <laughs> waiting on uh, Dr. Baldwin yeah. to uh, make some statements in reference to that and then we'll allow you to talk about Dr. Anderson and, and Dr. Uh, Howard yeah. and they'll talk about, and we'll use that period to uh, talk about some things in yeah, reference to yeah. this book. I'm Lewis Baldwin and I've been here many, many times to talk to Dr. Haney, not only about Dr. King but a number of other subjects. Thousands. Uh, I'm a native of Camden, Alabama. I grew up in uh, Camden, Wilcox County, Alabama, educated in the public schools of Alabama, uh, graduated from high school in 67, uh, matriculated at Talladega College from 1967 to 71. Uh, from there to Crozer Theological Seminary where I received the Master of Arts and the Master of Divinity degrees and, and at, from there to Northwestern University, uh, where in 1980 I received the PhD degree in American Christianity. And since that time, 1980, I've been involved in King Scholarship, uh, published a number of books and many articles. And we are here today to talk about uh, a scholarship on Dr. King. I've been involved with Dr. Anderson and Dr. Howard in a book on the spiritual leadership of Dr. King. And we want to talk about our different contributions to that book and what that book means in terms of the advancement of King scholarship. Very good. And of course, Dr. Anderson, let's have you to make some statements within mm -hmm. the framework of what Dr. Baldwin mm -hmm. has said. Yeah, sure. Uh, Dr. Baldwin and I have collaborated on the book Revise Our Soul Again. It was my first attempt to actually take seriously the scholarship one Martin Luther King Jr. Mm -hmm. As most people who don't mean recognize that, that I was very slow at coming to <laughs> actually appreciate the life and work <laughs> of Dr. Dr. Martin Luther King Jr. given my own background mm -hmm. in, and being merged in black power, black theology, in which uh, I had to find ways of reconciling uh, the re re relationship between black power and the work of King. That became a lot easier as I reflected upon my upbringing. It became easier when I saw and, and began to appreciate the work of my grandmother, who certainly had pictures of King all through the house. But it didn't touch me.